Hello friends, good day. Welcome to our YouTube channel GKR Soft. In this video, we are going to discuss about AutoSAR interface. In our previous video, we have discussed about AutoSAR layers. To understand more about AutoSAR interface, AutoSAR layer knowledge is more important. If you didn't watch it till now, please watch it my previous video. I have mentioned my previous video in the description. Please watch it. Interface types of basic software. Interfaces of the basic software are grouped in three categories. One is AutoSAR interface. Second one is standardized AutoSAR interface. Third one is standardized interface. You can see this slide. Here I have mentioned all the interfaces. So these interfaces will be helpful to make a communication between the AutoSAR software. For an example, in the application layer, we have mentioned the AutoSAR interface. But in the BSW, we have mentioned the standardized interface and standardized AutoSAR interface. Now we will see more details about, about these interfaces. First we can see AutoSAR interface. AutoSAR interface will be used in the application layer. AutoSAR interface will play a main role to make a communication between the software components. You can see this image. Here we have mentioned the AutoSAR interface and this AutoSAR interface will be helpful to make a communication between software components. At the same time, it will make a communication to BSW as well. And this AutoSAR interfaces will communicate via RTE. I can say some example for AutoSAR interface like sender receiver interface, client server interface. And this is relevant, relevant of modeling of software components. Standardized AutoSAR interface. Mainly the standardized AutoSAR interface will be used in the system services. As its name mentioned standardized, these interfaces name can't be changed by anyone. For an example, dem underscore set event status. This is a common interface name will be described in the AutoSAR standard and this can be called via RTE from the application. So, fast based on the arguments, everything will be fixed that it is called as a standardized AutoSAR interface. And this is typically used for services in base software. Standardized interface. Here in this picture, for more clarity, I have used the numbering to notify the standardized interface. Especially this standardized interface will not be used or shall never be called by the software components. This will be used only in within the BSW. One example is com underscore send signal. This is an example for standardized interface. And standardized interfaces are typically used between software modules which are always on the same ECU. Within the network, if you want to make a communication between the ECU, then you can't use the standardized interface. This is the basic understanding about the AutoSAR interface. Now finally, you whatever the takeaway from this video is, AutoSAR interface, this is mainly used in the application layer and ARXML description is required. ARXML means in AutoSAR, every file with the extension of ARXML and standardized AutoSAR interface that will be used in the BSW and mainly used in the service layer. Standardized interface, this is not relevant for modeling of software component and that also will be used in the BSW. Thanks for watching this video. If you like it, Please share it to your friends. If you want to stay with us for more AutoSAR technical contents, please subscribe our channel. Have a nice day.